everyone, it's your girl Talisa here and welcome back to my channel. Today hairstyle is as simple as it is. So I'm using this expression twisted up here, springy twist 3x. The number is number two and it's a 16 inch. Also, this here is what they use to do distress locks. So I'm using my jumbo crochet needle. So I started by parting off the circumference of my hair and then I twist both sides and let it meet at the back and then I make a twist just to secure it so it won't go in what I'm going to do first. So I catch the hair top with my scoochie so I can get to twist the hair around the hair properly. So anyways, after twisting the hair, I started by doing some cornrows. I do some loose cornrows. I didn't want the cornrows to be tight. As I said, this hairstyle is very natural, so I didn't bother to like any look of finesse about it. It's just simple and nice. Anyway, my hair is freshly washed and blow dry. I also use my Jamaican roots castor oil in my hair. Using my castor oil, it leaves my hair feeling soft and nice, and it's also stop my hair from shredding. Anyways, my cornrows, I did about, I can't remember. <laughs> so anyway, I do some loose cornrows, as I said, because I didn't want my hair to be too tight. Because when I do some tight cornrows, when I'm pushing through the needle and my hair, I started, my hair started to pinch like it's ruining my hair. So it's best to do it slack once your hair have the length as mine. But if it's a short hair... All you have to do, you have to do it tight so the hair can secure properly. So this package of hair comes with three bundles and each bundle comes with 10 pieces. As I said, it's a very simple hairstyle so it doesn't need a lot. And when I interlock this hair, I didn't tighten it at the root because I want it to be loose so everything would be puffy. So normally you'd tighten the root but in this hairstyle, I didn't tighten the root as I said I want it to puffy and synthetic hair normally loose once you install it in your hair it normally swell out especially a hair like this this hairstyle took me an hour to done and uh, guys tell me what do you think about this so far and what i did to um after doing all my cornrows i use my crochet needle to interlock the end here underneath my hair so instead of using the needle and thread i use a crochet needle to pull the hair under and there's no leave out you want to be very careful when doing this hairstyle because don't forget it's a synthetic hair and when you're pulling through the hair sometimes the other hair that already in will come in and then it will be tangled up so you want to be very careful when doing all of that Pulling through the hair can be difficult at times because um, sometimes the hair just pull like where you push your two finger in to hold the hair to pull it through. Sometimes the hair can slide down and then it's make it more harder for you to bring it through. So you want to be very careful when also doing that. And then it comes with a lot of pain. Even though this hairstyle is very easy, you still have a technique how to do the hair and the technique is to be very careful and always make sure when you're pushing through your finger, make sure you do it properly and no hair don't slip down or slip over or some more than some and then it, and sometimes you have to undo it just to do it again. To save you that more work, just do it one time and just be very careful. I push it on the two here and I close it at the top. And also, as I said, you want to be very careful when doing so that the hair won't tangle up in the next hair and then it's harder for you to get it through. And doing the hair like this, when my hair is loose down, like when I have it let down and if someone should look in the top of my head, they won't see 
my scalp the all they see is hair so the best for you to just secure it like that after installing all the hair i went ahead and i undo the twist around it, the circular motion twist and then i use this um new edge control that i try uh this name is tai chi something like that it's a new brand so i tried it out and guys it did lay my hair properly and i keep this hairstyle for one week and guys you can also try this edge edge wax because it does work good i mean i was thinking that it would have melt like mo like most of them does do but it did not melt and also i went over it with my gummy hair gel just to make sure that it is secure but i didn't have to use it but i use it as i said i keep this hairstyle for a week and my edges was laid my natural hair was still laid and i have no problem with it at all guys tell me what do you think about this hairstyle and what happened my hair right there i just leave it just like that and then i pull it out what happened why my hair look darker than the actual hair it's because the hair is a number two and i had dyed my hair a while back just to fit a different hair anyway tell me what do you think about this whole hairstyle it was simple nice and classy your thought is appreciated and i'll be in the comment section don't forget to watch like share and subscribe tell a friend to tell a friend and see you guys in my next video goodbye